gardener. Linda, this is Thomas. Thomas is 11 years old. He's my sixth son, and he has a plant. What is it? Tell her what you got there. Where would, where'd you get that from? Flower. Really? Garden. Let's see it up close here. Wow, that is beautiful. Beautiful. Tell her about it. What's it like? What's it feel like? The top feels fuzzy. Yeah. It's the artichoke. Don't move around so much. I can't pieces. keep it in the camera. Yeah. Those are the parts that we usually eat, right? Yeah. Okay. It's so got it was a, a full artichoke and it opened up into a flower, right? Yeah, and it's got kind of a lavender honey milk smell to it. Just a little or is it strong? It's really strong. Yeah, it smells like honey to me. It's just wonderful. And it's beautiful. It was a little little more blue before. It get pinker as it goes. We got another one that turned brown, right? Mm, yeah. yeah. And those are the seeds right there. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Okay. So say hello to Linda. Hey. Show her your smile. Yeah, there's Thomas's smile. I love Thomas's smile too. Thomas helped me put garden uh, beds in today. Flower uh, for the garden, not flowers, but garden beds. Yeah? Yep. Yeah, what'd you run? The sledgehammer? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. What else did you do with mommy? I pruned a whole bed of raspberries. Did mommy get any raspberries today? About a bucket about that full. That wow, that's lots of raspberries. Okay, buddy. Say bye. Bye. Five years ago, Lori, the boys, and I pulled up our roots and moved to Chile. Let me tell you, it was really scary. We were looking for an adventure. An adventure of a lifetime. And what we really wanted was just a peaceful place to call home with kind and gentle neighbors. We wanted to enjoy the life that God gave us. Free, simple, safe, and more beautiful than you can ever imagine.